there is a way to present and pitch the project you have. And I call it the five P's. The people who's involved in the project, the project, that's the next P, the product, the project, what's the property? And number three, what is the positioning? What makes it so different? What makes it so unique? And uh, then number four, the performance. What are the numbers? How much you're gonna invest? How long is it gonna take? What do you expect in returns, etc. And then number five is the profit. Notice this gentleman came in to uh, present to me an incredible project beachfront to develop a hotel in Vieques, which is a small island next to Puerto Rico. So, there is a way to present and pitch the project you have, and I call it the five P's the people who's involved in the project, the project that's the next P, the product, the project, what's the property. And number three, what is the positioning? What makes it so different? What makes it so unique? And uh, then number four, the performance. What are the numbers? How much you're going to invest? How long is it going to take? What do you expect in returns, etc. And then number five is the profit. So if somebody puts 20 million, they're going to get 30 million. How long? What's the risk, etc. So he was presenting. When people present, they are not organized mentally to present in that sequence. People, project, positioning, performance, and profit. So I told him, ah, you don't mind if I ask you questions, then I ask. So what is, so who's involved? Who are the people? You're me and a, and a partner. I've been with the partner so long. Okay, what's your experience? I'm a civil engineer and the other guy's an architect. We've done businesses. Okay, good. So now I know the people involved. So tell me about the project. Oh, we're going to do 120 rooms, then we decided to do time shares, it's going to be 108, we're going to do condos, and we show you some pictures, now I know the project. What's the positioning? Positioning is we're going to be the only one beachfront in this location, this coming here, there and down here. Now I know the position. Number four, performance. He said, oh, I don't have the numbers, but I, I think we're going to sell it. It's going to be worth this million. Okay, you need to send me that. What's the profit? He said, let, let me tell you about the numbers. Let me compare it to my numbers on a smaller deal, and I can show you where the numbers should be. And we ended up on a very positive note, and he's very willing to share. Really cool guy. Um, and, and you look at somebody and you say, okay, this is what he wants me to do with him, but I think I can do with him this other thing. Or maybe we can twist it that way or change it that way. And guess what? He came in for ABC project, and you take him to an XYZ project, and you both benefit more. So you pay attention, you help them present in the right way. And when you present, you do it the right way. People, project, positioning, performance, and profit. And that's how you raise capital. And that's how you make millions with practice. I have trained people to come in and present and I show them exactly. They bring their projects. They present it in that sequence. I show them how to do it in a PowerPoint. I show them how to develop a business plan in one hour, not two, three days. And when you present it so succinctly and so clearly, and people feel and understand, feel your energy and your excitement with reality of facts and figures. Because your presentation got to have three things. The words, the numbers, and the pictures. I repeat, the words, the right words, the right numbers, and the photos, the pictures that say, here's where we are, here's an aerial view, here's the rendering, here's how it's gonna be, etc. Now they understand. Even if they don't necessarily believe in all the things, they understand and they can compose the right questions. And that's how you say, here's what we do, here's what's in it for you, and here's what you need to do about it, and you raise the capital. I do this in intensive training. I spend with people the time to actually learn exactly how to present their projects, how to raise capital with a private placement memorandum to create their own funds, where I show you how to draft the fund, how much to raise, how much to actually make from that raise, how much to pay in a way that is safe, ethical, and profitable, and at the end, how you're gonna pay them from the profits, where these people will invest with you and will bring their friends. And once you finish one project, they wanna invest again and again. So, 
how to present, how to draft the actual legal paperwork. I give you the exact process that I did it. I coach you on presenting and give you feedback so you're succinct and you're clear and you're able in, in the 80-20 rule with 20% of what you say, you're gonna raise 80% of the money. And that's how you do projects that are 10 million, 20 million, 100 million. It's the same formula. What project do you have? And if you don't have any, I'll show you how to start right away with co-sponsoring with me, where you have my paperwork, my presentation, my history of performance with the SEC for over a decade. Started in early 2009 when we were already launching a fund and my whole team was working with me and we have grown. We have different types of funds, Reg D506B, Reg D506C, Reg A+. And don't worry about all this terminology. I will train you on this. I will show you how to do it and your dream will happen. Because if you're only limited by how much money you have and how much knowledge you have and how much action you can take, you'll never grow to your maximum potential. You, it happens when you put the pieces together, work with the right people, and I'm willing to work with you. Are you willing to give it a chance? I'm right here. Let's make it happen. Jump into commercial real estate discussion like these people. Apply for CRE Mastermind. Click the link in description.